It's day 84 2016 and we have news of HTC 10's boom sound, Sony's new focus on mobile gaming, Google's Periscope competitor and more on today's news. Let's begin. First, I'm going to start with a tip. You might already know that Samsung has provided a free Gear VR headset for all pre-orders of the S7 and the S7 Edge, but you should also know that it doesn't come with a phone or with a box. It's actually redeemed with a coupon. Before April 30th, that's the last date you can redeem it, you should register yourself in the My Galaxy app with the same mobile number you used for purchase. And then after 4 days of activation of your mobile phone and after you are done registering, you can redeem with a coupon which will be available on the My Galaxy app and you can use it on the Samsung eStore to get a free Gear VR which ships 90 days after March 18th. Those who hadn't pre-ordered the phone will still get a 50% discount on the Gear VR in the similar way. Sony has set up a new company called Forward Works, which will develop PlayStation titles for mobile devices. This company will be leveraging the existing wide array of PlayStation content and will be adapting it for the mobile devices like phones and tablets. This move comes as Sony is rethinking its strategy in gaming and uh, it's even changing its name from Sony Computer Entertainment to Sony Interactive Entertainment. So we'll be seeing a lot of changes here and it is good to see these changes in Sony as the mobile gaming world has often been neglected by the big companies. So it's time for your turn Nintendo. Google is reportedly working on a new live streaming product that will compete directly with the likes of Periscope and it's called YouTube Connect. This will hopefully leverage the existing creator base and will create the easy live streaming option directly to phones just like Periscope and even Facebook's recent live streaming option. Google definitely needs to be a competitor in this space and YouTube Connect seems to be the right way of leveraging the platform's hugely popular stars and hopefully creating something like Periscope and Vine together, maybe. So that's YouTube Connect and we are hoping we get to hear more of it soon. We just learned yesterday that STC 10 is coming by an online event on April 12th. We already know a lot about this phone but the information keeps dropping and the latest information from STC's teaser is from a tweet which says that there will be a new version of Boom Sound on STC 10. Well, STC's Boom Sound has been one of the most underrated features if you ask me. The Boom Sound speakers are awesome and it will be fantastic if the boom sound on the HTC 10 actually surpasses the older versions of boom sound. That will be pretty interesting. But from the renders, we can't say where the speakers are going to be. So let's see what happens on the 12th because certainly we need to know more. And on those same lines, I want to ask you this. How important are speakers on a smartphone for you? Do let us know in the comment section below. This is today's point of discussion and uh, that's about it for today's show. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you later with more technology news.